Huh. Oh, come on. Oh, fuck. Looks like Uncle Chad stabbed with a knife. So it's down there? Dude, that's... How are we gonna... Okay, let's do it. I can see better now. Oh. Oh. What? It was like... Was it just me or was it pitch black down here before? Like I couldn't see this before. Gotta get that crow. All right, where are you? In a graveyard? We'll come back to this. So it's this way. Oh. Wait. Didn't I come up this way? Had I, I... But I didn't walk through the graveyard. Hmm. Not that one. Oh my god, there's so many of these. Okay, the bird is somewhere around here, because here's the Jesus statue. Well, there's also a cross. So I guess maybe it's over here. Fuck, I don't know. It's one of these, though. Isn't it? Oh my god, I must have looked straight at it at one point. One of these. Aha! Hello there, crow. Looks like you have some blood on your beak. Well, we know where that goes. Now, what about this? All dark in here, shit. Looking in all the pews. Okay, maybe there's something over here. It's well lit over here. Huh. The lantern was broken. Hmm. Weird. Wow. Okay. Well, I got that lantern for some reason.
Hmm. Let's not move too far away from our objective. There we go. Wow. Yep, this definitely was just inside him. There's blood all over it. quite all of it yet. Weird. So these, their beaks touching create a spark? I guess this is like oil. This is a dark corner over here. Alright, well I guess we gotta look for more clues. I think I fetch that lantern before I was supposed to. Let's check this. There we go. Huh. I guess that was supposed to show me that it was inside the church or whatever. Not quite. We're almost there though. Looks like there's one more we gotta we gotta get. Oh. Well that was it. That was the sound we needed to hear. Hey Chad. All right, let's do this. What's happening here? This looks like Ethan's dad and his mom. Looks like she just smacked him over the head with a with the oil lantern. He did it again here, and he's just watching. Oh, there's Travis. There they are talking over here. Well, this is gonna be tough to figure out the chronology. What was that? What is that? Oh, it's just weird. <laughs> I don't think I'm supposed to see that. It's like the tree inside. Oh, that's kind of funny. Okay, um. Looks like we found the ones over here, so there's probably some... Oh yeah, right, right here. Oh. Oh, fuck! So he's... Strangling... Ethan's dad. Ethan's mom... Stabs him in the back, why? So these are clearly the last ones. I'm guessing this is one? Well then what about this? 
Okay, this is one. This is two. This is three. I don't know. And then four, five. Visualize. Oh. The hell's going on? Where's Ethan? The one who sleeps must Oh, that was incorrect. So wait, so here, she, it sounded like she was under control of the sleeper. So maybe that's last, actually, which would make this first. Let's see if that works. Our boy. Chad is putting our boy in that crypt. And bricking him up. Giving him to the sleeper. Forever. All right, so that's correct. Chad, get off of him! So not that. Are these not? Damn it. Our boy. Chad is putting our boy in that crypt. And bricking him up. Giving him to the sleeper. Forever. You know he's harmless. You know this is wrong! Chad, finish those bricks before he wakes up. Oh. Chad, let me see it. Get the hell away from me. Dale's fault. He should have been helping. Dale's weak. He always has been. You're right. He is weak. Chad, get off of him! He's your brother! Get off of him! <laughs> The hell's going on? Where's Ethan? The one who sleeps must not sleep. Your Uncle Chad is dead. Gross. Ethan. our boy. Dad, I need to get into the mine. What? Mine? My, my key. I, I don't have it. I guess I'll use the tunnel near the gate. Just, just keep mom away from me, alright? She's sick. You're all sick. Huh. The sleeper must not sleep. Ethan disturbed something. Whatever it was, it got out, into the air, and into the minds of his family. Interesting. You know, this isn't a horror game. Well, not a... Hmm. It's not overtly horror. It's got some psychological stuff in there, though. Some pretty scary themes if you will. So I'm guessing we go to the mines next because we seem to be following Ethan 
Well, that's not true because that clearly happened before the railroad tracks. I don't know. And we go up first. Way? I'm not really sure. Oh. Maybe nothing's this way. Okay, never mind. We'll just keep going along the path, I guess. Looks like it turns up anyway. What do the dead have to say? You'd be surprised by how little they know. The dead can't explain what it means to be dead. They walk downstairs that disappear beneath their feet. Headed for some bright blade of memory they'll never reach. Jeez, man. All right, then. Where the hell are we going? Holy crap, man. I hope this is the correct way. We're getting way off track. Hey, hey, hey. What is this? What? Well, this isn't scary or anything. Alright, let's go inside then. Nothing over here. Let's go in here then, I guess. Oh my god. This wooden mine elevator doesn't really look that secure. I would never ride in something like this IRL. Pretty much never. Yeah, nope. I would never be caught. I wouldn't be caught dead in this. And that's the most likely scenario that I would be in something like this, is dead. Hmm. 
Hmm. <laughs> okay. We'll go this way then. Because it's the only way to go. Lots of dead ends here. Don't really appreciate that. Wow. So who else lived here besides Ethan's family? Just wondering. Alright, it's completely pitch black over here. Uh. Oh. That's not scary or anything. I really hate underwater stuff. Up. Oh, wow. Is that Ethan? No, that's the mom. This is the victim. Time to find some clues. Yep, one pickaxe is gone. Where is it? This way? Oh, perfect. It's seriously pitch black. Oh, wait a second, I can make something out. Nah, I can't. That's not really useful. But thanks for telling me that it's this way. Anything else? Maybe I need to light something up before I can see where it is. Alright, something's gotta be around here. Enter. I don't think I can move this. Look at this thing. I don't think it can actually take these rocks out. Let's move it back, I suppose. what the point of that was. It was on top of something? No, oh, wasn't on top of something. Weird. So this is boiling. What? I can go inside it? <laughs> what? I was wondering if there was any way you could die in this game. Apparently not. I 
I feel like we're getting way, way off. I could feel two kinds of darkness here in Red Creek Valley. The first you walked into, and with any luck, walked out of. But the other darkness was deeper, stickier, uh, unknowable. And it wanted me to leave. Thanks for that creepy, vague description of nothing, Paul. Alright, I'll be right back. Alright, let's do this. Hey, we did it! What if there are any clues back there? Let's step off for a second. Hello? Clues? No! No clues! Alright, I guess we'll just keep going then. Hmm. Oh, I see. It turns around. So we can go through this dark part. Maybe we'll find that pickaxe that was in the dark. Since this is kind of a light source. It's not kind of a light source. It is a light source. Alright. Critical viewers, be on the lookout. There it is! Aha! It's right there, sir. Come on, Paul, let's get a move on. Ow! It has to be lit up, I think, in order to interact with it. Right there. Okay. It's not a pickaxe, it's a crank, though. Oh no, it is a pickaxe. Any blood on it? No? No blood? I took it. Let's take it back to the, uh... Place where it belongs. This little rack over here. This nice rack. Whoa! Does that mean we can already... Oh yeah, it does. Wow. Okay, I guess we gotta put together another chronology. Wow, they went everywhere though. Shit, we gotta find them. Oh. So there's Dale slumped over, talking to his wife. She's looking pretty high and mighty. Very proud of herself. Dale, did you send her down? I think he did. Well, wait, he pressed up. Hmm. What did you do with that pickaxe, Dale? What did you do? Okay, we got another one over here. I guess they didn't go as far as I thought they would. There's Dale with his pickaxe. Doing something. And the chronology is complete. One? I don't know, there's uh, there's only four. Unless I'm mistaken. No, there's five. Okay. Two? So then he sends her up. So that's three. Right? And then he takes the pickaxe from the rack. And he goes over here with it for some reason. Let's see if this is correct. I don't think it is. Honey, he probably ran. But why wouldn't he? Why would he be here? Shit. That was probably a raccoon. No. No, I don't think it was. He's just a kid. 
He didn't disturb anything. He just found a room in an old house. That's it! Oh boy, is the price. I'm going up there. The sleeper must not sleep. He can't get away. It's the sleeper's time to awake. Missy, listen to yourself. No. I see clearly. The sleeper breathes inside me. You're sick. We all are. Dale, what are you doing? Oh. I thought I heard her She's, voice. She's, um, still looking for you. Y you need to leave. Go through there. Through that water? It kind of looks like it's boiling. No, no, it, it's just a simple chemical reaction. It's not actually boiling. Mom! Mom! Where are you? I'll deal with your brother. Just go, now! Interesting. He had the gas cans that we saw at the rail car murder scene. He didn't kill his wife. She was no longer who she once was. Neither was he. Something was using all this pain and death. Something was becoming stronger. The sleeper, perhaps? Is the sleeper just their... Like, synonym for death or something? That's if I want to go back into the... Okay, so I guess we're done. Huh, that was a very quick murder scene. We only we only actually picked up one clue, it was that pickaxe. Alright, are you ready? Let's follow Ethan through the boiling chemicals or whatever. 